Get the rest of it. Hey, bro. Haven't seen you in months. You need help with your bags? Let me get them for you. Oh. Honey, hit the table now. Darius, Davis, Marivik, what do you think now? Davis, what do you think now? Call your brother. Yeah, all right. What the hell is all this? Yeah, it's dope, huh? Oh man. I know you ain't throwing these out. Warren G. Fuck that. What's that connection? You ain't in hip hop no more? Not really. Did your college ass get all too sophisticated or something? No. Just moved on to other things. You can have them. Hell no. The niggas is two play, man. See, this is the type of shit that belong like a hip hop mausoleum alongside Bell Bid Devon Arrested Development. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I can't be hanging this on my wall. But I'll take your CDs though. Yeah, right. Hey. Who this Bobby looking dude right here? What? Bob boy right there. Man, don't you know that fob is a racist word? He's a racist fob? He's Andres Bonifacio. Oh, the hell's that? He was one of the leaders in the Philippine revolution against Spain. He founded the Katipuna. What about that fob right there? Hey, I told you, don't use that word around me. Oh, my bad, my bad. Sorry, dog. That's Philip Veracruz. He was the vice president of the United Farm Workers Union. Hey, bro. Mm. Did you know that it was the Filipinos that started the great boycotts? 
and not the Mexicans who always get the credit. That, that, that dope. Hey, how come you ain't got no shoe lady? What? No, Melda, the shoe lady. I mean, you got all these 5 fives on your walls, but you ain't got no shoe lady? Where's the Fabi shoe lady? What? What'd I do? Hey, bitch, what are you thinking about going out of Yeah, all right, Dad. I hurry up. Gotta go do doo Yeah, wait a sec. Come on. Hey, you know I think our bro's got fob on us? What? You know fob? F-O-B, fresh Filipino off the boat. <laughs> Whatever. Nah, nah, that shit's real. I mean, he got all this wacky jungle shit on his walls. And he talk all weird now. How brainy like. You don't like that mouse with the big head? And go see for yourself. Yeah, let me just fix my hair. Come on, it's coming out. We got a can downstairs, you know. Shit. Take your shit. I'm not going anywhere. Bill, turn on the fan. Maribic, where are you taking now? Call Darius. Yeah, Dad. What the hell are you doing? Oh. It's called a bahag. They forgot tribes in the Philippines to wear it. It's cool, huh? Uh, yeah. Hey, where are you going? Oh, so what do you think? Are your eyes green? Yeah, they're contacts. So, uh, what are you trying to impress? Oh, nobody. I gotta go back to the mall. I'm working at double shift. Nice, um, jock strap. Maravik? Yeah. That was quick. Hey, diarrhea. Fastest way to go. Hey, so what'd you think? You gone fob. <laughs> about time, fool. I mean, you've been saying that shit for months. Now I'm just getting more play from the hoochies. Nigga, please. I mean, so you got an air rack. The only thing females are gonna notice is that ugly head attached to it. Shit. This little earring is gonna get me more hoochies than I know what to do with. And when I get my tongue stud, they're gonna be coming back for more. <laughs> Nigga, you gonna get a stud in your tongue? The hell for? See, this is where I gotta educate your ignorant ass on the intricacies of the female sexual psyche. Nigga, what? It's a sex thing. What? You your dumb ass never seen Pulp Fiction before? A tongue stud helps fellatio. Fellatio. Nigga, do I gotta repeat myself? Nah. Uh, bro, are you sure you know what fellatio is? Yeah, I know what the hell it is. Oral sex. What? Yo virgin ass never performed fellatio before? <laughs> I can't really say I have. Well, I got my technique down. I don't be tickling or nothing. I'm the fellatio fucking master. Where you guys been? Your mother need help there. I was in the bathroom. Me too. Both of you at the same time? Yep. Did you guys call Darius? Yeah. Me too. What is he? I don't know. Me either. Honey, call Darius. What about Darius? 
Oh, let's check now. Honey, let's check now. I cook good curry curry just for you. Hmm. Wait. Prayers. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Bless us, O Lord, for this thy gift to, but to receive from thy bounty to Christ our Lord. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Hey, wait. Where's Lola? Oh, your grandpa likes to eat in his room. You know, he doesn't like to get up. Honey, where's the bagoon? Oh, sorry. How's your classes? They're okay, I guess. I don't know. How's your grades? I guess I did okay. What's the problem? Nothing. Hmm. I uh, joined Cabo Bayan, a campus organization for Filipino students. Oh, really? Yeah, I got to meet a lot of uh, Filipino students. Mm. The club's pretty cool. We do a lot of Filipino cultural stuff. And uh, we're petitioning the university to get Tagalog language and Philippine history classes. Is this some kind of crazy radical group? No, Dad. It's just a Filipino club. I learned a lot about the Philippines at the meetings. Filipino classes? In college? That's weird. What do you mean, weird? I don't know, it just doesn't seem very college -y. So what are you gonna do this summer? Maybe nothing. I wanna relax. Maybe uh, you can give a part-time job in the hospital? I don't know if I wanna work. I'm kinda burnt out. How about you? Mm -mm. Ah, you feel... I'm feeling kinda burnt out myself, you know? What do you mean you're burnt out? From what? The 11th grade? I get stressed out, all right? You know, I got a lot of adolescent pressures. Yeah. Well, since I'm the only one working, I get to use the car. I'll drop you off. You just want to cruise with your Filipino gangster friends. Yo, you are too ignorant. Because first of all, me and my boys are not gangsters. Second Filipinos do not cruise. We race. Ooh. What I was meaning to say by that is that we uh we cruise. But sometimes we cruise in matters which I don't want that car to be used for gallivanting around. It's not like I'll just be bumming around. I got a lot of important things to do. What things? Stuff. What stuff? Things. And after that thunderous 360 degree from the free throw line, backboard shattering jam by Shaquille O'Neal. Spud Webb needs a perfect 50 to win. Can you do it, Spud? Hell yeah. Ball headed genie ain't got no skills. Back for the summer. I missed you. 
So when did you start playing the lottery? Lottery? No, no lottery here. Uh, okay. Well, get some rest, okay? What the hell are you doing? Oh, oh, you mean this shit right here? Oh, see, this this what I call practicing my hang time. You know what I'm saying? What? You know, get my hop so I can dunk. Oh, man, check this out. See, the more I jump, right, the higher I get in shit. You know what I'm saying? But I, I figured if I also hang here like so, then I can stretch myself. You know, I'll be like growing and shit, you know what I'm saying? Ha <laughs> ha, keeping it real. Have you been smoking that Indo shit? What? Yeah, what, what the hell that got to do with it? Nah, man, this right here is physics and shit, you know? I mean, pretty soon, I'll be jamming like smuggers, you know? Dunking like donuts. I'll be physically fit, you know what I'm saying? D. I have no idea what the hell you're saying. Five feet and uh, five inches. Yeah? All oh, right, man. That's the bomb diggy. Cool. How much have you grown? Oh, no, no, no. I ain't grown nothing. I just want to make sure I was measuring my shit properly, like, you know? And I was, too. Uh, yeah. See? All I gotta do is get up to five feet, seven inches, and I'll be dunk with no problem. What do you mean? Well, cause see, five, seven is how tall Spud is. And he got crazy mad hops. Spud? Who's Spud? Who's Spud? Spud Webb. You know, little man kicked Dominique Wilkins six foot nine ass in the slam dunk contest. See, Spud may be a midget, but he got crazy dunking skills, you know what I'm saying? That's the way I figure. All I gotta do is keep practicing, stretch myself a couple of more inches, and I'm in there like swimwear, you know? That's enough for me. Yeah, you don't want to strain yourself. That's not, it's not like I couldn't do any more. Oh, yeah. So, um, do you run here often? <laughs> that is so cute. Actually, I do. I try to stay in shape. I'm trying to get that perfect Barbie doll figure. <laughs> <laughs> you don't have to try very hard. <laughs> Why, thank you very much. So, Kurt. <laughs> I'm Kurt. <laughs> like uh, Captain Kirk, but with the T at the end. <laughs> oh. Thank you very much, Kurt. You're very welcome. Oh, Marvik. What? Morik. 
Mary. Just call me Mary. Yeah, I have an aunt who is Chinese, but you look a lot better than she does. Uh, okay? That was stupid. Um, are you Japanese? Nope. Uh, hablo espanol? What? Okay. Um, are you Hawaiian? Yeah. Yes, I am. Good guess. That's cool. Were you born there? Yep. I was born there in Hawaii. In Hawaii I was born. That's why I'm Hawaiian. Which island? I, I went to Oahu on vacation. Yeah, I was born on a... that one. <laughs> hey, we have so much in common. I mean, you being Hawaiian and, and me having been there. <laughs> what a quinky dink. <laughs> hey, uh, you want to get a bite to eat? Yeah, sure. Cool. si Kadi? Paano yan? May hindi pa nabibinyagan yung huling baby niya. Sus Mariose, kung hindi lang ako takot sa Diyos at Katoliko, bibilihan ko yan ng maraming condoms. Ay, hindi. Kung isip-isipan lang tungkol sa condoms, hindi yan kasalanan. Kung gagamitin mo lang, Lolo? Oh, did you get any lotto numbers, Lolo? No. Do you want to come out? No. I made breakfast for you, Lolo. You want to come out and eat? No. It's your favorite. Fried rice, eggs, and spam. Spam? Yep. No. Lolo? I brought you breakfast. join you. Oh, wait. You can't forget the secret ingredient. It's not just ketchup. It's banana ketchup. <laughs> Lola, what are those? The metal's in the frame? My medals. Uh, oh yeah, your medals. That's what I thought. I mean, what are they for? When you were in the army? No more. Stuff Marabi. I told you three times. She's working. Just 
always working late. She hardly ate with us. She should be going to school. Why don't you talk to your sister? She won't listen to me. Besides, she already got a lucrative and promising career as a mall technician. <laughs> <laughs> Did you get that financial aid in the mail? Not yet. Hope it's enough so I won't have to work next semester. It better be. That tuition, too much. Honey, where's the bagoon? No more. What? No more? No more bagoon? Can you pick up some tomorrow? I can't. I'm meeting Emmy after work tomorrow. We're planning a surprise baby shower for Connie. Can't you go out there? What? You can't go one night without your bagoong? I told you to stock up. By bagoong, six pack. I can go, Mom. Thank you, dear. You also want me to get Lola's lotto ticket? What? Lotto ticket? Don't you guys buy him lottery tickets? No. Oh, well, maybe it's about time he did. Honey! Honey? What? Do you want breakfast? What did you say? I can't hear you. Honey? Can you make breakfast? It's good to see you up and about, Lolo. I cook good breakfast for you, honey. Thank you, honey. I love you, honey. I love you too, honey. Davis, a little help. Bro, you think I'm busy? Uh, Lolo? You wanna come out? I made lunch. What's your favorite? Okay. Uh, I got this for you. Sorry, that's all I can get. been doing nothing but a hang from that damn step all day, neither. I know. Stupid ass Filipino midget jeans. Oh. How is it? Hmm. <clears throat> 
Do you want anything else? Juice? No, no. Um, it's good you're getting out of that room. I guess you do when you go get your lotto, but nobody actually sees that. My lock and numbers. Big pick never works. Oh, cool. Bring me good luck, huh? So, what you gonna do with all your millions? Lolo, what are you going to do with all your millions? Good food. Well, I gotta go do some stuff. Hey, why don't you start eating dinner with us? You don't gotta be all alone in that room. What up, D? What's up? See that there? It's the island of Mactan. It's where Datu Lapu Lapu Jack, the European imperialist Magellan. Yeah, cut that punk's head right off with only a rattan stick. Over there is where Dr. Jose Rizal was born. And that's where the famous Philippine rice terraces are. Yeah, hey, um. It's I weird. Was I can name all these historical sites and geographic locations. <laughs> Too bad I don't even know where our own family is from. Yeah, hey, me and Ro wanna go to DJ battle. You got any bones? Sorry, bro. Oh. Spend it on Lola's lotto ticket. You know you- Shit. And hey, Mary, you work? Give me some money. Abortion? Di pwede yan. Murder yan at makasalanan sa Diyos. Ano? Hindi si Roger ang ama? Diyos mio, e sino? Isang puti? At ang pangalan ay Barry? Oh, e ano naman kung uh, illegitimate? O half-breed yung baby niya. Basta hindi niya dapat uh, papatayin yung baby. Ay, kung minsan, Emmy, talagang mahirap kang kausapin. something what it's been so long since you have had dinner with us yeah Maribig you're never home I meant dad here you go what the hell's this it's Lola's favorite I guess so. Oh, Mom, did you tell everyone the news? Mm, what news? Mom says she'll teach us to speak Tagalog. What? We could practice at dinner. Oh, and Lolo, you can teach us some Melocano. Merrick, paki abut mo ang kanin? That means. Please pass the rice. Salamat. That means thank you. Cool, huh? Uh-huh. Cool. Who the hell does he think he is forcing that fog talk on us? Oh, our nice little Filipino family can sit around our nice Filipino table, and we can all speak Filipinese out of our Filipino asses. Uh, excuse me, ma'am. I think y'all meant to say, 
speak Tagalog. Ain't no such thing as Filipino weeds. Whatever. I told you college was gonna make him a loony. I mean, he always run around half naked like a damn savage. He thinks now that he's some big ass college shit, we gotta do what he says? And what's with making Gramps eat with us? He likes eating alone. So Gramps eats with us, so what? I don't know. I mean, haven't you ever wondered why Gramps eats with his hands? And? It's kind of barbaric, don't you think? I mean, he's got a giant wooden spoon and fork hanging on his wall, and he eats with his hands. Oh, right. Yo, I mean, he's gonna be gone by the end of the summer anyhow. I wish he'd stayed up and got the summer school. Hey, so you gonna use a car tomorrow? How many times do I have to tell you? I work every day except Thursday. So you're gonna use it? Yeah. Tomorrow's Tuesday. I'm only off on Thursday. So are you working or not? <sighs> you just better remember our deal. A world unification, so much complexity, what a pity No love in this city, a stranger, but wait, danger Lurks in the ghetto of the mind, keep an enemy at bay With lyrical finesse to give urban youth spirit and clarity No social programs are What up, nigga? Hey, dog. What up? Hey, dude, why don't you return my page? You paid? Yeah. Ah, oh, you did. Oh. <laughs> See, man, why the fuck you gonna have that thing for if you ain't even gonna use it, dude? Nigga, I use this shit. It's only for the honeys, the hoochies, and the hoes. Yeah, whatever, Felicia boy. <laughs> <laughs> Man, fuck you. Still can't believe you let me do that. Man, I could still feel that damn hole, man. You ain't gotta get it taken out. You know, I told you. I'm cool with your choice of lifestyle. <laughs> Yeah, we'll see who's laughing next time I have to pick your no car having ass up, nigga. Yeah, shut the fuck up, bitch. Hey, make some useful and help me put the shit up. Why don't you pick it up yourself? Nigga, come on. Damn. Watch out for that oil. Oh, shit. Got your Lolo ticket, Lotto. Is that really sad? The line was all the way out the store. It's supposed to be up to 50 million. Good. My numbers. And you're lucky. This time, I'll not lose. Soon I'll be back in the local store. Dog, you almost done? Hey, dude, what's the hold up, man? Nigga, shut the hell up. God, nigga, come on! Put your back into it and shit! Wait up, nigga! Shit's all in the way! Yo, why you guys gotta keep these damn Christmas lights up year round? Santa Maria y Locosor, my home, beautiful village, lots of farmlands as far as the eyes can see. I wish I could see it. Come, come with me. 50 million should be enough for two tickets. Uh, not to be totally negative, but what if you don't win? I mean, there is that chance. Oh, no, no, no. Lucky numbers, lucky grandson. I mean, you see? 
Yeah. 90 inches, dude. According to my calculations, this shit right here is nine feet exactly. That shit's tight. Nigga, look. Nine feet ain't regulation. And even if you do jam, the rims are whole foot short, so it ain't gonna mean shit. Nah, nah, not even, man. You don't understand my next level mental state, dude. Check it. This is what I gotta educate your ass on some scientific principles, you know what I'm saying? See, I got it all figured out, all right? Since the rim is on the driveway, that means I gotta run up to an incline, you know what I'm saying? Now, being that I gotta be running uphill, dude, I got gravity totally working against me, you know what I'm saying? See, before, when it was at 10 feet, Damn, that's like I'm trying to dunk on a 11 foot rim, you know what I'm saying? But now that's in our feet, it's like I'm jamming on a 10 foot regulation rim, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> that's keeping it real for your ass. Nigga, what the fuck you talking about? Dude, just watch. The reverse? The 360 jam. Oh, almost. From the free throw line. Didn't you know I put in the second world of art? Yeah, but that's about all I know. This one looks cool. How'd you get it? That's the bronze star awarded to survivors of the Bataan Death March. Yeah. I kind of remember when you got it. I was just a kid. What was that like? The Death March, I mean. When Bataan surrendered to Japan, the Japanese forces pushed us too much to the concentration camp. Four days, four nights, we marched. No food, no water, nothing. My comrades who fell were beaten, many were stabbed with bayonets. I remember it was anger. Anger and pride kept me going. I vowed not to let those bastards break me. I wanted to stop, but I can't. Anger kept me on going, marching, marching. It makes me sick that you have to go through that. I never learned anything like that in class. I mean, about Filipinos. Hey, so, maybe if you do some black coochie, your son be able to dunk. Yeah, but then, he still be half Filipino. So his punk ass forever cursed to be a jump shooter. Yeah, I never seen one Filipino looking dunk. That makes me sick. And, and no matter how short black folk are, they all can. Where you be getting this shit from? Dude, that's just for real. It's like in the blood. I mean, Spud Webb, he's barely an inch taller than me. And Muggsy Bogues, that little black man just like what? 5'3? Five, 5'3. Three? Five, three. 
fucking Sean Bradley with a tan compared to that guy. Hold up. So you saying Muggsy Bogues can dunk? Yeah, nigga. Dude, that nigga's hard. Muggsy Bogues cannot dunk. Where you see that little nigga dunk? What? I ain't never really seen him. Uh-huh. Hey, but he must be able to. I'm, he's black and he's in the NBA. What more you need? Nigga, you straight up whack. All right, look, look at it like this thing. You see why I make a jump, right? Yeah. All right. So, so you're gonna tell me that that Woody Harrelson, this this white, dumb ass, pornographic bartender, can dunk, while Muggsy Bogues, a, a black professional b-ball player, can't? Well, if you put it that way, I guess he can dunk. I wonder why he don't do it in the game though. Too modest and shit. So, Mary, what do you want to do tonight? Okay. I want to, like, rent a bunch of Jean Claude Van Damme movies and, like, pig out on a pint of Cherry Garcia. Mmm, very romantic. You, me, and Van Damme's bare butt. <laughs> oh, don't feel threatened. I heard he works out his bottom, like, every single day. Yeah, he can, like, crush coconut between his butt cheeks. Very sexy. I mean, you're not exactly Jenny McCarthy, either. So, Jenny McCarthy is like this incredible woman slash goddess. So what? <laughs> Jealous, are we? <laughs> yeah, right. She is beautiful. So, how about I rent the tapes and come over to your place? <laughs> TV with your mom if you want. Huh? Yeah, that'd be a lot of fun. What's going on? Man? What do you mean? I mean, we've been going out for a month now, and I have yet to step foot inside your house. Uh, it, it's just that uh, my parents, they don't like non-Hawaiian type people to come over. So this is some sort of racial thing? What? They, they probably don't even know I'm not Hawaiian. Well... That's it, isn't it? They don't know. Uh... I don't believe this. They don't know I'm not Hawaiian? You're like getting a little too serious here. I'm getting too serious? I mean, you weren't that way last night. I don't mean it like that. We can still do it. Oh, uh, yeah. You are one fine looking motherfucker. Except for that zit you got. Ah, oh, damn. See ya! Let's. Hey! Hey, what are you doing? Hey, hold up! Damn it! What? I need the car! I'm rolling to the beach today! Well, some people in this world do have to work. Looking like that? Yes. That's bullshit. You lying bitch. It's Thursday. Remember? Your day off? Not anymore, Atomic Snoopy Dog. I'm working over 50 hours. Come on, I gotta use it. Sorry. Besides, does it like look really cool doing a drive-by in a beige four-door Mercedes? Stupid bitch! What's wrong with you? Who the fuck are you? George of the Jungle? And that bitch took the car again. At least you're doing something. What are you doing, you string cheese head bum? Man, shit. <laughs> Only reason she working is so she can pay for the damn nose job of hers. What? That believe McBimbo is working her ass off so she can get a pointy white nose. Wait. 
Do mom and dad know about this? I don't know. I'm just gonna go ahead and do it. And you didn't say anything? Kind of had a deal. What deal? Well, you know those basketball rims that are like attached to a pole so you can keep readjusting the high like it ain't no thing? Yeah. Well, she said if I didn't say nothing, she'd hook me up with one of those. You mean you would let your own sister disfigure herself just because you want a new basketball rim? It's a new adjustable basketball rim. Man, you know how hard it is to keep Ren hanging that piece of shit outside? You know, I just thought of something. You are pure evil. Man, it's not like I ain't paying for it. I mean, she get the car every day. I know she better come through an ideal. But you better not say shit. I learned a new uh, sentence in Tagalog today. You guys want to hear it? Alam niyo po ba na magpagagawa ng ilong dyan si Marvick? What? So when are you going to tell us? Eventually. When? I don't know. When the time was right. When? When I felt like it. You mean after you've done this already? Look, I'm 24 years old. I should be able to do what I want with my life and my nose. Not while your nose is still living under this house. Well, maybe my nose will just have to move out. Look, Maribic, you are still my daughter. Still? What? Nothing. Why didn't you tell us? Well, now we know. Let's not dwell on it. I'm not dwelling on it. But if I have to dwell on it, I will dwell on it. Dwell, 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 dwell. Look. She is serious about this, so let's deal with the problem. You approve of this? Like she said, it's her nose. Besides, she is working for it. I don't believe what I'm hearing. Do you believe what you're saying? Because I don't believe what I'm hearing. Well, maybe my nose will just have to move out. Maybe. You are See, now they're going to let her do it, let's thanks to you. You just had a gold stick your nosy ass into other people's business. Shut up. Don't you tell me to shut up. Cause you, I'ma lose my backboard. Bitch ass, you're gonna have to fork over them bones if she don't pay for that shit. You know how fucked up that is? I mean, that's so fucked up. I told you not to I say shit. I said shut up. Hey, what are you doing? Huh, you can't fade me, bitch. Sorry that happened. You know I'm just looking out for you. Stay out of my business. There's nothing wrong with the way you look. Man, why don't you just leave her alone? Why don't you both just leave me alone? I'm just trying to get your back. You're just trying to get your back bored. Oh, so it's like that, huh? Like that it is. Damn, let's get out of here. I did? You damn right I'm on my back bored. Your bulimic Baywatch butt is gonna pay for it like you said you was, too. I don't think so, you little wannabe nigger. Wannabe nigger? See, I ain't no wannabe nigger. Hey, don't even go there. Thank you. It's African American. He's a wannabe African American. And who asked you, Jungle Book Boy? You didn't sprout head. Will you both just get out? I ain't done with you yet, you green-eyed coconut. Coconut? Yeah, coconut. Brown on the outside, but lily white on the inside. Yeah, well, if I'm a coconut, then you're a... a rotten banana. A rotten banana? Yeah, because you're black on the outside and yellow... No, you're black, white... Oh, just shut up, you little wannabe nigger. Hey, I told you. Wanna be African American. You know, you're the one who started all this with Oh, I'm Mr. Filipino College Man. I'm so mature, I think I'll go tattletale on my sister. Yeah, that's right. You start all this. What? You started all this. You're the one who told me. Yeah, you started all this. 
Like, I'm supposed to know he cares if you got a fucked up face or not. Well, it doesn't matter anyway, because you could kiss your backboard buh bye And Mom and Dad, they're letting me do what I want. You're letting her do what she wants? You know why she's doing this, don't you? You ever hear of mental colonization? Sell out? Coconut? Oreo cookie? Talk to your mother. Mom, you really not gonna let Mary get a nose job, are you? She's only doing it out of shame and insecurity. And you know how expensive those things are? I mean, you realize how many countless hours she has to slave away working so she can get a pointy nose? It's like she'll be all tired and worn out. Do you really want that? Oh, uh, you need help with those? Thanks, Mom. Oh, you're welcome, dear. <laughs> Put away the groceries. 24, 25, 32, and 47. Shit. Once again. Uh, yeah. Remember? Lucky numbers, lucky grandson. I really see. Damn it. 16, 24, 25, 32, 32 Nak nam puta. 44, 23, 34, puta 12, 18, 24, Visit. 25, 32, and 41. You bad luck. And remember, you can't win if you don't play. Damn. I've been waiting for your bitch ass all morning. Your punk self said 10 o'clock. Hey. It's 12 now, so according to Filipino time, I'm an hour early. Who says there's nothing good on TV? Excuse me, excuse me. What's my motivation? Image is nothing. I'm not a role model. Parents should be role models. Hey, who say you can play on our court? Yeah, man. Why don't you go play with someone your own side? Why don't you go play on a rim your own side? We are. You guys leave. This is my school. Yeah. And this is your ball. Go get it. Uh, bro. That was your ball. Oh, my bad. Hey, kid, want to play with us? Damn, look at that little nigga. Well, I bet you, if I just like an ounce of black blood in me, man, I know I could dunk on a regulation rim. I read they got like this extra bone in their foot, and that will make them jump higher. Bugging dog. Ripping man. That's true. I mean, I read that shit in school. That's physics and shit. Yeah, 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 whatever. And man, you believe what you want. All I know is that all black folk got like an extra bone in their right foot and it worked like spring. Yeah, it's documented scientific, physics specific fact. Whatever. Man, you don't believe. All right, then I'm gonna prove it to you. Hey, little boy. Oh shit. Hey, yeah, yeah, you. Come here. My friend wants to see the bottom of your foot. Today's the day, huh? As a matter of fact, it is. That just kills you, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. What? Does that make you feel good? 
Yeah, it does. I got my financial aid check in the mail. Oh, good. Yeah. I can probably quit my semester job now. Can't believe summer's over. Only one more week. Wait a bit! Isn't she supposed to get a new honker today? <laughs> I wonder if her boogers will be white too. <laughs> Don't make fun of your sister. Um, Mom. I was wondering. When's the last time Lola's been back to the Philippines? Not 40 years. I can't even remember. Why? Oh, I was just thinking that maybe it might be cool if y'all made a trip there. Lola's been wanting to go back. Your grandpa is too old to be traveling now. No, he's not. Besides, I think he wants to move back there. Oh, really? And where's he going to stay? I don't know. We gotta have some relatives back there still. Nobody's gonna take him in. There's gotta be somebody. Look, dear, I know you've been spending a lot of time over your grandpa, and he likes to talk, but he's not going anywhere. Well, what about the rest of us? We cannot afford it. Do you know how much it would be? Plus the cost of your college? Maybe I can take some time off school and work. And be like your sister? Work in the mall all your life? You have to pay the school. What's the point? I'm not learning anything anyway. Maybe you should be studying more. That's not what I mean. Look, I'm just thinking, if we don't plan to go soon, we never will. We're just so busy right now, Darius. It's not important. And Mary getting a phony nose is important? We're not going, and that's final. Hey, everyone. The new Marivik is home. <laughs> oh, my God. What happened to you? Happy two-month anniversary, sweetie. I fixed my nose for you. You broke it? No, silly. I had it fixed. You went and got a nose job? Yeah. Since it was our two-month anniversary, I figured I'd surprise you. But you can't see it for a few days. Can I, like, come in now? Now, why the hell would you go and do that? For you. For me. OK. Actually, I did it for me. But I did have a naughty dream about you during the operation. Mmm, were you good? Of course, the operation did last a lot longer than 10 minutes. Why in the world would I want you to go do something like this? Wait a minute. You're like mad? Uh, yeah, like I am. I mean, why would you go do something like this without telling me? Duh, if I told you it wouldn't be much of a surprise. I don't believe you. <gasps> me? What about you? I can't believe you. I just want to look beautiful for you. Wrong. Nothing. But I'm right here, and it's where I belong. And I'm not giving up, and I'm not going back. You okay? Of course. Can you tell? Uh, you want to talk? No. Just leave me alone. Okay. My boyfriend dumped me. Oh, sorry. She got a boyfriend.
I'll buy ticket next time. My lucky numbers can't overcome your bad luck. Uh, yeah. Uh, Lolo? Maybe it just wasn't meant to be. No, I'll be back in the local shore. I don't mean you won't go back someday, but I really don't think you're gonna win the lottery. Maybe there's some other way. Maybe, maybe you can, uh... You are right. I'm too old. No, Lolo, that's not what I meant. I'm acting like an old fool. Wake up, Mary. Wake up, Mary. You having a bad dream, Mary? Or should I say Marvick? Huh? You lied to me! No! Liar! You think you found me a basketball rim? A new adjustable basketball rim! I lied! You're going to tell us, are you? You're not even who I am! You are Filipino! No, no. I made your favorite eggs, uh, eggs and spam. Lolo! Don't worry, dear. He's probably just resting. Yeah. I have one of this a long time ago. And your mother, she liked to play with it during. <coughs> anyway, you're going back to school very soon? Yeah, I guess. You, Darius, the first year of college is the hardest. But if you open your book a little bit more, everything will be easier. And you'll uh, enjoy it more. And you made your uh, flat arrangement yet. Oh, I was gonna. You better not. Do you want me to? Damn, you actually want that stupid ass Bobby Jock strap in public. It's called the Bahag, you ignorant koosh ball head. But you know something though? All you look like is like a Bobby Brown monkey that ought to be swinging from a vine. Hey, you're the dumbass who wasted the whole summer hanging from the damn stairs. Uh, who's the monkey? Man, what the fuck happened to you? Dude, you used to be one of the homies, man. You used to keep it real like a true nigga. 
Keeping it real like a true nigga? Think about what you just said. You damn goggle. Fuck you! Go anyway. So how long? Fracture the metal tosser bone. Six weeks. And you? They say I have some kind of infection and it's not healing right. One more week. Damn. That's fucked up. But I also lost my job. I refuse to go and work looking like this. Huh. You got a nose job, but then you lost your mall job. Isn't it ironic? <laughs> uh-huh. And, and I suppose that the white boy don't get any more blow jobs. Okay. <laughs> so I guess you can use the car now. <laughs> You're so funny. So, uh, where am I going to be getting my backboard? <laughs> 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 nah, seriously. Hey, Mervyn, throw that damn snot out your nose. Get everything you need? Yeah. We'd like to take you to the airport. But uh, me and your mom has to go to work. And Davis, he has to rest his put. And Marivik, well, she says she has to rest her sinuses. It's OK. You call a taxi yet? Yeah. We'll be here in about an hour. Have to get to the office. Okay. You stand your heart over there. Okay, Dad. Okay, Dad, yes, I have to run. Did you take it back to your grandpa? No, not yet. Well, don't worry. He'll come around. You know, he's a little stubborn. Yeah, he is. Okay, you take care of yourself there, all right? Yeah, Mom, I'll be fine. Okay, and be sure to call as soon as you get in. Yeah. Okay, bye-bye now.
لالا لالا Dark is here. Where's everybody? Mom and dad left for work. Maverick and Davis will be sleeping till noon. Oh, let's go then. Yep. Two course tickets to Manila. In a few days, we'll be in a local sir. Who needs the lottery when you got financial aid? And your tuition. So I'll keep my job and work overtime. Should we be doing this? No, but I figure it's now or never. Don't worry. I left the note on the fridge. Your parents will be upset. It'll be a lot more than that. But it's worth it, right? Of course. Driver to the Philippines. Higher than I could climb. It seems I made 